routine workout is about to happen. Hello, YouTube. Welcome to today's class. Make sure you grab your three pound weights. This is going to be an amazing bar booty sculpt uh, class, 30 minute class. So it's going to be amazing. We still are going to work a little bit in the arms and the core, uh, and then we will get mostly into the legs today. So who's excited about that? Um, we've got me and Richard, Danica, Susan, Carly, and Harshi. Uh, so many amazing people here. Hello from Russia, Indonesia. Um, okay, guys, this is amazing how many people are here today. Let's go ahead and get started right away. So today we're going to start with some core work. Who came to yesterday's Pilates class? I was sore, or I am sore today, which is awesome. Like I love feeling sore. Okay, we're going to start on our backs right here. We're going to get nice and warm by pulling our knees towards our chest and then tapping the toes to the floor and pull in and tap the toes to the floor. I'm gonna readjust my Instagram video. Keep going with that. Tapping the toes, pulling the knees in towards the chest. Tapping the toes, pull the knees in towards the chest. Good, so you're going to feel that lower core starting to turn on and get your body connected with your breath. Moving all together. Great job showing up here today. I mean, that is amazing, amazing work. Good, now we're gonna to begin to twist in the lower core and work those obliques. So I like to get into the core before we get into the legs so that we can actively, mindfully turn on our core. Good job, so that when we're working our legs, your core is turned on and also working. Good, keep going. Nice, we're gonna twist, 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 twist. Keep going for 10 and nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Bring both of those legs straight up towards the sky. And then we're going to lower the legs nice and straight down and all the way up. Beautiful. Keep those legs all the way together. Point those toes. Good. And then your hand is on your neck to support your head and neck. And slowly lower down. Great. Squeeze the ankles together. Have a little bit of pressure there so that those inner thighs and deep lower core belly starts to turn on. You want to get your deepest, deepest muscles working here. So we've got all sorts of core muscles, right? Not just the six pack. There's the muscles underneath the six pack. There's the muscles to the sides of the six pack. There's the muscles that wrap around to your back. We always forget about our back. There's all of our pelvic floor muscles. Those are also part of the core. Good. And lift up. Let's do five more like this. You probably are getting nice and warm. And five. And up. Good job. And four. You guys are excited to work our booty today to get nice and strong, to feel confident. Three. And up. Feeling so accomplished every time we show up at our mat here together. You are doing awesome. Great job. Two, and up, and one, and up. Great work. All right, go ahead and flip on over quickly into a little forearm plank right here. So come onto those toes, come onto those elbows, bring those hips down. Good, and then we're just going to do little tiny lifts up. I want you to think about actually bringing the elbows towards the toes and lower. Just tiny, baby little lifts. Little tiny lifts. Give yourself a little crunch. Good. Feel a little crunch happening. It happens really deep inside the core. A little tiny crunch. Good job. Let's do 10 like this. 10 and 9 and 8. Good. 7 and 6. 5 and 4 and 3. 2. And one, hold it here. We're going to tap the knees down towards the floor and then lift the knees back up. Good. And tap up. I'm definitely sore from yesterday's class, so it's, it means it's a good one if I'm sore. So make sure you guys go check that out on my YouTube channel. It's under the live quarantine playlist. Seven and six, five and four 
and three, and two, and run wide right away. I'm gonna place the elbow down and turn over to the side for a nice side plank. Good, we're gonna tap the, the uh, hips down and lift for 10, up, nine. You can place the hand behind the head if that's easier. Eight, and seven, six. Beautiful work, keep it up. Five, and four, Woo! three, and two, uh, and one. Go straight to the other side. Don't put those knees down. Just place the elbow down and flip right on over. Let's do 10 right here. And 10. Up. Nine. Up. Eight. And seven. Six. Beautiful. Five. Four. Three. And two. And one. Now place those elbows down. Don't come down. Hold it here, hold, 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 hold. Good, we're gonna shift it back and then rock it forward. So you're gonna push into the heels and then push into the toes. Good, we're gonna go for 10 and nine and eight. You guys know I don't like to waste any time. Seven and six, so take a break when you need to. All right, I'll leave it up to you to take breaks. Good, and five and four. Three, you are so strong, you've got this. Two, and one. Come on down. Whoo! All right, core is on now, right? Yes, okay, so now we're gonna grab our weights and you're going to lower down onto your stomachs here. Now, if you don't have weights, you can do this without the weights and you will still feel it, I promise. Place those toes on the ground. Reach those arms back behind you. Shoulders are drawing down the back. And we're just going to do little pulses up, up, up right here. Feel the neck nice and long. So actually look down at your mat. Once you see what I'm doing, then go ahead and look away from the camera or from the screen and look down at your mat. Good. I'll keep leading you through. And up, up, up. Good. Arms are lifting up. Up, up, good, for 10, and nine, and eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, nice job. Okay, go ahead and let go of those weights. We're gonna reach those arms for our toes back. We're gonna go into flying Superman. This is always one of my most favorite exercises for the back and arms. Okay, squeeze those legs together. So this is really about getting the whole posterior chain. Turn on. Let's go lift up. For, we're going to do two sets of 10. Good. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 more set of 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay, let's do that one more set. Time. Two sets of ten. Let's go. And ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. One more set of ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Did you guys feel that? You guys felt that in your back, your legs, even your inner thighs. I'm out of breath. Okay, take a quick sip of water and then we're gonna move into legs. So this is a bar booty class so we are going to work mainly on our legs. Great job. Okay, let's see. I'm feeling my legs and arms from yesterday. Awesome, need to engage. Transverse abdominals. Hi everyone, hello, hello. Okay guys, grab those three pound weights if you have not yet. And we are going to start with our booty exercises. All right, so you should be nice and warm. Okay, so one of my most favorite ones is to come into this nice little um, zigzag position here. Now, let's do it without the weights to begin. So you're gonna be like this. Maybe it's better to show up just the side, like this. Okay, so now hands are gonna be on the floor and you're gonna lift up, 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 like this, good. So pull the lower belly in, 
And you're gonna lift that knee up. Nice job. Okay, and lift. You might feel it right away. Three, two, one. Again, 10. We're doing 30. Okay, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good. So now we're going to extend the leg back behind us as far as you can. Maybe it goes straight back. Maybe it goes a little bit at an angle. That's okay. Either one. Good. For 10 and 9, 8, 7, 6. You might need to drag the foot on the floor, and that's okay too. Good. 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Nice job. Now we're going to tap the foot in front of us, and we're going to extend all the way straight back behind us. Nice, you're gonna tap it in front, and then you're going to extend back. Good. For 10, and up, and nine. Great job. It's always the hardest just showing up, right? Clearing out your schedule, rolling out of bed, putting on something, some athletic wear, right? This is all I've been wearing lately. Well, it's really awful. I usually everywhere, but it's actually my favorite kind of clothes, you know, my workout clothes. Good, five, and up, and four, and up. Good, you are doing an amazing job. Three, and two, and one. Good, we're gonna hold the knee lifting up here. We're gonna do a little tiny squeezes. So I want you to actually squeeze and engage that uh, hamstring. You're gonna wrap it around behind you, like a little scorpion's tail. So we're gonna wrap behind. Good, we're gonna do this for 20, 19, 18, 17, 16. So you guys know I'm all about body weight strength training. So there is so much, so much strength possible for you in your body when you just work within your own body. All right, so I know we're all stuck at home and some of you guys are um, used to working out at home and some of you are maybe missing your gym, but hopefully when you join my, one of my workouts, you'll see that you don't need all that gym equipment. There's so much you can do with your own body. Good, now we're gonna add the weight. If you want this extra challenge, this is where you would add a weight. So I have three pounds here. You could use less. I would recommend three or less. Three, two, or one. Okay, so you're going to squeeze that on in, in the knee right here. And now we're going to lift up again for 10, 9, 8, 7, good, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 more set of 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. How is that? Now it's getting, now it's getting real. Okay, so that booty is working. Now we're gonna do that scorpion's tail again. Let's go for 20, 19. So now I'm squeezing it behind. 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Hold it here. Hold, hold, hold. Can you do a little baby lifts? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And good job. Let's switch over to the other side. Whew. So come on to a seated position. So you're sitting upright, but then my hands are on the floor. Okay, use the arms to help keep your posture lifted. Try not to get over here like this. Okay, so now we're going to start by lifting 10, 9. So we're doing 30 of these right here, figuring out kind of the logistics of your body. So it might feel a little foreign to you. If your knee is over to the side of it, that's okay. It just has to do with how much external rotation you have in your hips. So this is great. This is great to uh, this is this is bless you. This is great to really strengthen your hips and to um, yeah, strengthen your hips and mobilize your hips at the same time. So that's what's great about body weight training as well 
is that you can um, strengthen and lengthen at the same time. So you're stretching into the muscles while you're toning, while you're uh, strengthening and sculpting. It's pretty amazing. Good. Last five, four, three, two, one. We're going to extend it out to the back. Okay, here we go. And 10, 9, 8. See if you can float the leg, but you might need to, to kind of drag it on the floor. That's okay. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Nice. Now we're going to tap it in front and extend it back. Good. For 10, and tap, and 9. Pull that lower belly in and up. So that's why we started with core, is so that it's turned on for the whole class. Okay, so we activated it. We made that mind-body connection so that we can um, use it and have it support our back and create a strong posture here. Whew, five more. Five and four and three. Two and one. Oh boy. Okay, so now we're gonna do our little scorpion's tail, wrapping it around. Let's go ahead and lift that knee up and wrap. Good for 20, 19, 18. Really squeeze the booty. Think about your hamstring. Squeeze your hamstring right here. Actually make connection with your mind. Good. This is going to help you. Create a really strong mind-body connection. So you are activating it from the inside out. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Great job. Now grab the weight here. Squeeze it on in. If you're not using weights, that's okay. You'll just repeat the exercises, and you'll still get a burn. I promise. Good. Now lift. Good. You are so strong and you are so powerful within your own body. Use this time to really feed yourself some confidence, some loving words. Good. And five, four, three, two, one. It's these moments where you start to burn out. What do you tell yourself in these moments, right? Do you say, oh, I always am so weak. This or that, do you beat yourself up the entire time? Or are you your own best cheerleader? Remember to be your own best cheerleader. I can't get inside your mind. Well, I can a little bit, right? Let's, let's wrap it around. But you know what I mean. I can't uh, get inside your mind. So you've got to be your own best cheerleader. Cheering yourself on, telling yourself that you're doing an amazing job because you are. The fact that you are here today Woo! Oh my goodness. Five, four, three, two, and one. <sighs> okay, guys. How was that? I bet you felt that one, right? Okay, so we're going to stand all the way up. We're going to switch it up. Switch up the levels a bit. And we're going to go into um, a nice little lunge here. So I want you to step it back into a lunge. <sighs> And we're going to just fire up those legs in a different way. So pull those, that lower belly in, and we're going to go all the way down here and up and down and up. Nice. Now, you can stay here in this um, lunge, right, just using your body weight. If you want to add a little bit of weight, here you go. You can add your weight right here, adding some pressure down into the legs and, of course, those arms. Good. And five. And four. And three. And two. And one. Let's hold it here. Reach those arms out. Good. We're going to do little tiny pulses now. Don't go all the way up in your lunge. Stay pretty deep down into your lunge for ten. And nine. And eight. Keep your chest slightly forward. Six, five, four. Why did you burn so much? I don't know. Three, and two, and one. Good job. Let's go straight onto the other side. 
Step that foot back, and we're gonna lunge it out. So have the BH at the hips, so have a little flexion in the hips right here. Notice I'm not all the way straight up. Take your top of your body forward a bit. Here we go, for 10, and nine, eight, good, seven, and six, five, pull your lower belly in, four, I bet you're feeling this now. Three, keep going. Two, and one, nice job. All right, here we go. Little pulses in for 10, and nine, Woo. eight. Feel the burn, find a way to enjoy the burn, knowing that knees or muscles are working, the blood is pumping, you're getting stronger, three, two, and one. Stand it up, beautiful. Okay, let's come into a nice wide second position. Second position is a ballet term position, right? So the toes are turned out. You're gonna bend your knees into a grand plie in second position. We've got our weights in our hands. Nice, we're focusing on the legs today, but it'll give us a little extra for the arms and legs. So legs are wide. Little pulses out, little pulses down, and down, and down. Squeeze that booty behind you. Keep the chest nice and tall. Okay, so it's not a squat. Like I said last week, it's not a squat. It's not a weird squat or an awkward squat. It's a plie. Good. Squeeze that booty, press those knees back, and we're gonna pulse now with the arms. Pulse, and pulse, and pulse. I hope you guys have been Loving these live classes. I have really, really enjoyed it. It's been so fun being able to work out with you, connect with you, and also you get a taste of all of my different workout styles. I know a lot of you guys have jumped over from Instagram and joined me on my YouTube channel. That's where you'll find all of my follow along workouts. And a lot of you guys I've been downloading my Stretchy Fit app, the app that will get you flexible and fit. Because let's come into a ballerina arms here, and we're going to just do little lifts up. Lift the elbows up and up. Good. So if you guys want to continue working out with me, have a plan, right? May is coming up. May is coming up on Friday already. I can't believe it. April, we did all in April, so we do monthly challenges. Friday, oh boy. Friday starts our May Madness calendar. So you get a 30 day workout plan every month. So take a little breather. We're gonna do one more round of that. So you can really stay consistent because I've got a full workout plan for you every month. Pretty incredible, right? Up, good, now we're gonna take it all the way up, nice. Squeeze those glutes. Squeeze as you reach those arms up. Beautiful work. So nice big plie and up. Pull that lower belly in. And you're doing awesome. I can feel your energy right now. I can feel it. I know you're burning alongside me. But remember, when we do it together, we are so much better. Okay, let's do 10 more just like this. And 10. Nine, eight, you've got this. Seven, six, five, good. Four, and three, and two, and one. Hold it down, hold your plie. You've got this. Little pulses here, and pulse it out for 10, and nine, and eight, and seven, good. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Shake out those legs. How y'all doing? Okay, we've got just a little bit left of class. And, okay. All right, all right, let's go. We've got a little bit left to go. Let's place that weight behind the leg again. So you're gonna place it behind whichever leg you choose. I'm doing my left leg first. And then I'm gonna bring my elbows down. Tap the knee 
and lift. So I'm really using my hamstring. It's a little hamstring curl, as you see. Good. So we're doing 20 of these. Good. So we are definitely going to feel this tomorrow, this nice, beautiful sculpt that we're creating in our legs. People always ask me, do you lift weights? And this is about as, as much weight as I lift. Good. And six, in my whole life I was a ballerina, so I got really good at figuring out how to find strength from the inside out. Three and two and one. Okay, we're going to go to the side and up. 20, 19. You got to squeeze that weight. If the, if the weight falls out of your knee, you know you weren't squeezing the weight at all. Okay, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11. Use your core. 10, 9, 8, 7. These are so good for us because we're sitting so much on our booties, right? And we're not taking our hips into this full range of motion. So that's why you're really getting a lot of mobility when you do exercises like this. Three, two, and one. Whew. Okay, we are not done here on this side. So we're gonna cross it behind. See how my knee goes like behind the other one? Good, so you're gonna cross it behind and we're gonna lift up. Nice, so you're gonna cross behind and then pull the knee up like you're trying to touch your own shoulder, like this. Okay, you're gonna feel a little crunch in the side abs as well. So let's go for 10. You're gonna definitely feel the standing hip or the kneeling hip work of the kneeling on um, glutes. Good, seven. So we are hitting your booty from all different angles right now. Four. Because you've got the three different kinds of glutes, right? Glute, min, med, and max. Two. And one. Beautiful. Okay, we've got one more exercise. We're going to do attitude lifts right here. So you're going to turn out that knee and lift and up. Good. For ten, nine, eight, seven, six. Five, four, three, two, and one. Wow. All right. Whew. Take a little breather right here. How are you guys doing? Let's actually take this opportunity to stretch our feet. So I want you to actually tuck your toes underneath you like this and go ahead and sit back onto those toes. Bring the ankles together. This is going to be an amazing Stretch in your feet. So great active recovery before we go on to the other side. We get stuck in our shoes. And moving barefoot like this is really, really good. Stretching out your feet. The better your feet feel, the better your entire body is going to feel, right? That's why I've been wearing my Vivo barefoot shoes because they really do help to, you know, um, strengthen your feet. Okay, let's go to the other side. All right, so grab the weight, put it in the other leg, go ahead and lift it up for 20 and 19, 18, 17. Squeeze the weight. Good, so you can really activate 15 and 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, good, 8, 7, and 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Let's go ahead and go to the side now. Good, 20, and 19, 18, 17, great job, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12. I know you're starting to get tired, but 
You've got this. Use your breath to re-energize yourself and tell yourself you can do it, okay? A lot of your energy has to do with the words that you tell yourself. What are the words that you're saying to yourself right now? Continue to power yourself up from the inside out. Five, four, three, two, and on one. Okay. Whew. Okay, let's cross it behind. Remember, we've got that little side crunch now. We're gonna do 10 of these and 10 and tap it down. Nine and eight. Hopefully you guys are loving these exercises. I really do. Six, I just feel like my legs feel just so strong after a workout like this. Five, I really stopped chasing the aesthetics, although it is, you know, you get that as well. But I really started to focus on how do I feel inside of my body? Not just always what does my body look like, but how do I feel inside? Okay, we've got our last one right here. Open up that knee, lift it up for 10, squeeze that weight, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, and two, and one. Oh, goodness. Okay, guys, let's take a little breather. So we're gonna just take a stretch down here like this. Take those legs nice and wide and go ahead and forward pull down. Release the head. Good, stay down in your forward fold. I'm just coming here to check in on you guys. Whew. Nice work. This is a beautiful community. I see so many of you really, really diving into all of the workouts I've been doing every day. And remember, if you're on Instagram, you can go over to my YouTube and just get a much bigger screen over there. Okay, so you thought we were done, but we are not done yet. Pretty sure. Wait, let me check the time. Okay, so we've got a little bit left. Uh, and I'm going to take questions at the end. So we've got about five minutes left. And then we're going to take questions at the very end. Okay, guys. So we're going to take our little weights. We're going to place them on our hips. You're going to place the, the heels down towards the floor. And you're going to lift the hips up, lower the hips down, lift up, and lower. Lift and lower. Good. So we are going, this is going to be our last um, exercise. We'll do variations within this. But then we'll be done. Nice. You did so good. So if you want to add up, you can keep the weights here on your hips. Actually, let's just keep doing this. Let's do 10 more leg kicks. 10 and 9. Squeeze that booty up. 8, 7, and 6, 5. This is always so good to work. 3 and 2. And one, hold it here, little pulses up, up, up. Squeeze that booty underneath. Good, for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good, hold it right there, hold, hold, hold. Lower down, now we're gonna lift one leg up, so you may need to bring those feet closer together. Lift one leg up. Let's go ahead and reach the arms up overhead now. Good, we're gonna lower the booty down and lower the elbows down at the same time. And then everything lifts back up. Good. For 10 and 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, good. 3, 2, and 1. Hold it up there. Hold, hold, hold. Good little pulses for 10. 9. Press through that heel. 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one, good, let's switch other leg. Lift on up, and here we go. Lift arms and hips at the same time for 10 and nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, and two, and one, little pulses here, up, 
up for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Place the feet back down. Bring the weights back onto the hips. Lower down and lift again and tap. Up, tap, up. Good. So we're going to do that whole thing all over again. 7, good. 6, 5, you can add more resistance down onto your own hips as well. Good. For four, for three, and two, and one. Little pulses up at the top for ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Good. And then single leg. Here we go. For ten, nine, and eight. Really dig into that heel. Seven. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Little pulses. Ten, nine, eight. This is it. Last exercise. Four, three, two, one. Other side. And here we go. Ten, and nine, eight, seven, six. I'm feeling it. Five. Four, three, two, little pulses up. This is it. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Woo! You did it! I'm so, so proud of you. Let's take a quick stretch. If you're watching on YouTube, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. And if you want a daily workout and yoga plan, for you to stay consistent, get back into your routine, and feel absolutely amazing in your body every single day, then go ahead and download my Stretchy Fit app. You get 14 days free. Go to actionjackin.com slash app, and you will be so happy and so excited to be a part of our community, and it'll be awesome to have you in there. So, whew, guys, let's do a little cool down here. And I'll take questions as we cool down. Nice job. Okay. So I'm going to take my feet together, come into a little butterfly stretch here like this. Uh, let's see. SF production video says, will there be live workouts on your app? So yes. So app members still get the live workouts. So I will only be going live for my app members starting next week. Um, so when you join for the app, yes, you get the live workouts with me. Um, also, you tomorrow's class is a yoga bar fusion class, and that's going to be for my Stretchy Fit app members only. So if you want to join, go to actiondrapping.com slash app, and you can start your 14 days free, and you can cancel any time. Um, will there be light workouts on your app? What do you mean by light? What does light workouts mean? Do you mean like different levels? Because there's definitely definitely different levels. There's beginner, media, and advanced classes. Um, that's great. Love the live workouts. Awesome to hear. Yes, yeah, so I'll still be going live once a week for the Stretchy Fit app members. Um, and then, um, yeah, so uh, let me see what other questions I'm trying to read at the same time. Um, let's see, hurts so good. Okay, you can release the legs out, go into a little forward fold here. Let's see, any other questions? Um, are bands good for that last exercise that had no ways but wanted that burn? Um, yeah, you could definitely use bands. Let's see what other questions there are. My leg doesn't go that far, that's okay. Um, that's totally fine if your leg doesn't go as far. Let's see, hi from Ireland, 4 p.m. there, amazing. I love seeing that you guys from all over the world. Do you guys have any other questions for me at all? Any questions, any questions, fitness related, health related, life related, um, any struggles that you guys are experiencing right now? What's like, how are you feeling with everything going on? I'd love to hear um, what, um, it's gonna be a good Mother's Day gift. Awesome, so does that mean that you're getting it for yourself? Are you a mother? Yeah, this would be a great Mother's Day gift to yourself. Right? Mothers get to also get their own gift to themselves. Um, thank you, says Alicia. Thank you, says Susan. Will you be posting workouts every day on YouTube? So, no. So, this will be, so they'll be in my app. So, if you want a daily workout, 
you can get it inside of my Stretchy Fit app um, for me and my mom. Oh, that's awesome. That'll be an amazing, amazing Mother's Day gift. Um, yeah, so the daily workouts are going to continue inside of the app, and that way I can um, really serve and focus my app or, you know, my community and my app members. Um, let's see, when are you coming out with your own nutrition program? <laughs> yes, I know. People will always ask me for that. You know, I'm also experimenting with different ways of eating for myself, um, and I actually have some food vlogs that I'm editing now that'll be out on YouTube hopefully very soon. So I will let you guys know when those are out. Uh, let's see, do you always um, work out at home or just now? No, I always work out at home. So these are, I always do home workouts, home body weight training workouts and yoga. So yeah, so that is my thing. I love helping people do that. I love helping women, ladies, and some gentlemen like be able to fit their workouts into their schedule. So that's what the Stretchy Fit app is all about. So I can show you um, um, how you can do that. And it's really easy. And actually the app, I have some new updates coming on the app, which is really, really exciting. The functionality is just getting better and better. Um, the way that you can schedule your classes, stay accountable, um, track your classes. You can track your progress. Um, it's pretty, pretty amazing. Um, uh, let's see. I've been start I wish I could show you. I don't have – I have my Instagram – on my phone, so I can't show you the actual app. Um, let's see, I've been struggling lately with my nutrition. I also use, do you still contribute? So I did do a few classes on um, there, but no, I don't have any new ones that's coming out anymore. Um, so if you wanna work out with me every day, I highly suggest downloading my Stretchy Fit app. Um, let's see, I used, I've been struggling lately with my nutrition, great advice on those hip flexions. Uh, let's see. I need to get that app. Fiona, yes, we need to see you. Um, when's the May plan out? So the May plan is May Madness. May Madness is our next 30-day plan inside the Stretchy Fit app. So you can get a daily workout. May Madness sounds like what it is. It's going to be great, amazing workouts um, that are intense, and they're going to definitely challenge you. So that's the whole point, you know, to – I want you to see progress in your body. You will see progress in your body, actually. Um, and if you follow the guide, it's really simple. If you just follow the app, you follow the daily workout, you will see progress. Um, so um, do you guys have any other questions for me? I tell people about your classes. They don't believe that bar and yoga can really kick your butt. They're lost. <laughs> yeah, have them join at least one class. Um, have them come to one of my HIT classes as well. My HIT classes are pretty intense. Uh, let me see. Do you guys have any other questions for me? Uh, let's see. What else do you guys want to know from me? Any other places that you're struggling? I know some of you guys said nutrition, and I will be working on um, my vlogs for nutrition. Let's see, how long does it take to get accepted into the Facebook group so I can join? Right away, Caitlin, as long as there's a few questions that you answer on the Facebook group, and then we're checking that all the time. I mean, I'm in there all the time answering questions. So, Caitlin, if you download today, then, yeah, then you can um, – uh, um, oh, <laughs> okay, if you download today, uh, then, yeah, you can join us in the Yoga Bar Fusion class. Okay, look, guys, I magically got another phone. Here's my Stretchy Fit app. I wanted to show it to you because I realized I've never actually showed it on Instagram because, well, I'm on my phone, <laughs> so I can't show it. Okay, let's see. So these are the swipe on screens. we got to skip these. All right, let's see. Let's get inside. Okay, we're going to take a look inside. So here you have programs that you can follow. So right now this is the All in April program. So every month you actually get a new program to follow, which is really great. And this is what keeps people accountable, consistent. Every day I've got a workout plan for you. And it's balanced with HIT. It's balanced with um, sculpting classes. It's balanced with yoga, with bar. Um, I also bring in guest instructors, as you can see. So there are other expert guest instructors that come on 
and teach as well because I think every teacher has got something amazing to offer. So I love bringing in my friends to teach classes for you. I've also got meditations here. Um, then what you can do is actually schedule them into your app here. So you can schedule it into your calendar. Um, and then you can stay accountable. So this is your calendar here. And all of your classes will be lined up in here. Uh, and then I've got an on-demand section. So I've got all of these workouts that you can choose from as well. And then um, so you've got HIT, kettlebell, booty, um, core, cardio, arms, strength and flow. And see, I've got my friend Venus who came and did strength and flow. I have my friend Kelsey here who came and did her hip burn classes. I have um, my friend Marcus who's an amazing, amazing kettlebell instructor. So we've got all these cool people coming into the app teaching their expertise plus all of my classes. So you've got all of these yoga classes on demand as well that you can choose from. So if you're not feeling the daily workout here, then you can just go into the on-demand section and pick something out for yourself. Um, you can also search for level here if you want to search, you know, beginner class, intermediate class. Um, then I've got this morning kickstart plan that people are really, really loving. So this is a great little morning kickstart where you can, you know, do a morning class. It's a they're great 10 minute yoga kind of wake up classes. So we've got posture strength. We've got um, I've got aligned mobile spine moving meditation, stability power. So this is an amazing morning plan. So you've got other programs as well. So I've got toned in 10. So I've got a little, if you want to just get toned in 10 minutes, um, you've got that program. So these programs will continue to grow every single month as I just add more to it. Um, pretty amazing, right? Um, let's see. Uh, let's see what else. Workouts, yoga, calendar. And then we've got, an, in here, I do have uh, recipes as well. And I've got resources. So how to uh, have a social life and still eat healthy. And I've got five steps to simplify your nutrition, um, uh, food swaps, pantry staples. So I've got nutrition resources, nutrition resources and recipes. So you can go ahead and look through there as well. So Got some amazing, amazing things happening here, guys. And this app is only going to get better. I'm obsessed with it. I work on it every single day. <laughs> and I just, it's my goal to make it the absolute best possible app for you guys. So, um, so okay, guys, that is all for today. Great work. Uh, I just wanted to give you a little tour because I never have. I've never given you guys a tour of the app. Um, plus, we've got the community here, which is our private Facebook group, and the Facebook group is amazing. They are just so motivating and inspiring. They're checking in every day. It's pretty incredible to have a community alongside you every single day. That's what you know. That's what counts. It's the connection that you are able to create in these um, in this community. So, I really, really hope to see you inside. Uh, and. Yeah, let me know if you guys have any questions. You can always DM me. Make sure you check in with me after this class. Check in, check in, so I can um, share and sh repost you. And it would be amazing if you actually did like a video of yourself talking about it. So you can say, I, you know, I just did Jacqueline's workout. It was amazing or whatever it was for you. Um, and do that like, um, I love like talking videos so I can like hear from you as well. So that was, that's awesome. Um, Miss. Maggie Moose said, thanks for that tour. Awesome, Maggie. Are you going to be joining us inside? I really hope so. Uh, let's see. Um, okay. Do you need to do these type of sculpting sessions plus hit to see results? Uh, I guess, Fiona, like, why are you asking? Do you not want to do hit classes? What, what are you looking for? What kind of results are you actually looking for? Um, let's see. How does it, how long, okay, I answered that question. Um, okay, great, love from Germany, my legs burn, awesome, <laughs> love hearing that. Okay, guys, I'm gonna sign off, get some breakfast, and love each and every one of you. Big hearts going out from mine to yours, so happy you are here with me. And remember, tomorrow's Yoga Bar Fusion class inside of the Stretchy Fit app live, and then I'll be back here on Friday um, 
for a uh, intro to the headstands class. That's right, headstand class. So that'll be really fun. Okay, let's see. Uh, I showed you yesterday talking only to your members. Um, I don't know what you mean by that question, the real Sophie. No, I love it when everybody shares their, the class that they did with me. Okay, all right, I'm gonna sign off. DM me if you guys have any questions. I gotta get going. Love you guys. Bye-bye.